What kind of year is Carter Coughlin having for you guys? Uh, Carter's doing a good job. He's having a good year. Uh, you know, happy for him. Uh, last year was a little slow for him, but, you know, he's definitely picked it up this year, made some plays for us. So uh, it's been just fun to watch him grow as a football player. And I just see him kind of coming to his own, making some plays. And that's what he does. You know? So but now he's, he's done a really nice job this year. What do you make of it when he, you see a guy get fined for that, a hit like that? I mean, was, that's his shoulder, right? I mean, I, what, did you, do you even have an explanation? No. I mean, it's, I mean, we all see the tape. I mean, we've all seen it. I mean, it is what it is. And, uh, you know, yeah, it is what it is. It's amazing. So do you tell the guy don't make good contact next time? <laughs> it's a slippery slope we go down. I mean, you, yeah, it's, it's a slippery slope. You, you look at the tape, it looks like it's a textbook tackle. Guy gets fined, it's a slippery slope. T-Max, since we last talked to you, uh, <clears throat> Joe Shane had a press conference. He said punt returner was his bad. He tried to force uh, Eric Gray back there. Uh, what was your reaction to that or your input in that? I mean, that's, you know, like I, I tell you guys all the time, I make the gumbo. So whoever's, whoever's back there, that's who we're going with. And, uh, you know, it is what it is. I, you know, we get guys that are on the roster. We try and put them in places to make plays, and that's our job. Their job, our job is to put them in place. Their job is to make the play. So, you know, it, it is what it is. I mean, it's, that's that's just part of football. I mean, it's, you know, you get a guy, you think he can do certain things, and it's and it's still time. Like, Eric still has time. I mean, it's just the maturation process of growing as a football player and trying to figure things out. You know, that's just part of it. Now that you have uh, Kate on the practice squad, how does that help maybe developmentally? Like, is he just able to focus on whatever you guys have been working on? Or? Yeah, I mean, it's, it. you know, Kate's a young kicker. And, you know, you got to look at young kickers as a whole in this league. Most of them get cut, you know, three or four times, if not more than that, before they stick. You know, I had Mar Michael Pilardi when he was uh, with us in Carolina, he's a punter, but specialist in general, he was cut almost 18 times before he stuck, you know, and then he, he won a job, he won a job, and his first year, he was the second alternate in the Pro Bowl. You know, so, I mean, that's just, that's part of a lot of these guys' process. It's rare that a guy just shows up, gets drafted, or is picked by a team, and he stays with that same team for 15 years, like the Sebastian Janikowski's of the world or Justin, T you know, Tucker. I mean, those guys are a rarity. You rarely see those. Most of them get cut a bunch of times before they stick. Why do you think that is? That's just part of the process of kickers in this league. I mean, it's just because most of the time, young kickers, they're going to miss kicks. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, it's rare where you see a guy just comes in and his rookie year, you know, he bangs out 90% of, of his kicks. I mean, and it's just... less patience with that position? Now? Absolutely. 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 You know, you look at, you know, a few years back when we had Aldrich here. Aldrich was 75%, you know, his rookie year. And then he comes back the next year and he's, he breaks the franchise record for, you know, field goal percentage. So, I mean, that's just when you have talented guys, you got to commit to them. And then once you commit to them, you got to know, hey, look, this guy's going to miss kicks. You know, because they got to learn just like every other position. Young quarterbacks make mistakes. You know, running backs make mistakes. You know, they all make mistakes. They're young. <laughs> What's the the long-term outlook for him, though? Because, I mean, you have Graham. So mm -hmm. just how do you view that for him here? Right now, we're just working with him because he's here. And, uh, you know, he's very, very talented. Uh, and, you know, as businesses, you just never know. You know, you never know. So uh, he's, he's doing a really good job. Uh, but we just got to keep continuing, try and get him better, bring him along while he's here and just make him better. Bring him, make sure that he, by the time he leaves here, he's a little bit better than what he was when he left, when he got here. What makes uh, Jaden Reed dangerous to return? Jaden, he's, you know, Jaden, he's talented, talented kid. And we worked him out, I worked him out uh, this spring uh, at Michigan State. And uh, he's a very talented kid. He has a lot of ability. Uh, he can stick his foot in the ground. He can make people miss. Uh, and, you know, he has really good straight line speed. So we got to do a good job. I was showing the guys tape of him today. We got to do a really good job of just taking care of our business and being where we're supposed to be uh, as far as leveraging the ball, keeping the games out of the front.
consistency or something about him that we I don't think we've asked you about your long snapper all year uh, yeah. and what you know kind of what Casey brings Casey's the glue he is he's the glue to our special teams unit uh, he is the quarterback of our punt team uh, he he really Casey's I, I couldn't sit here and tell you how much he means to our special teams unit um, he's a great leader um, he's insightful he thinks like a coach on the field uh, he's a real leader in our room he gets the guys together every week he does his own scouting report writes it on the board they come in they watch it uh, they talk about it each group uh, you know each unit as a whole and uh, I, I couldn't begin to explain to you how much he means to us as a special teams group.